Good morning. I got out of the shower. This is my hair with uh, half dried. Here's my bed. So comfy. Anyway, um, who knows what's going on for today. I'm just editing as usual. Gonna eat as usual. Play Animal Crossing as usual. But what I'd like to know in the comments is how you guys are doing. So please leave a comment down below. Let's keep the conversation going because I don't know if you noticed, but I've also been uh, replying to comments on these videos. So take part because it'll give you something to do. And I'm really sore still for my workouts and stuff. So I think today will be a Just Dance Day. Allie and I haven't didn't do that yesterday but because he was like in meetings all day but it's fun for us to do together so that's what we'll do we're also planning to paint these walls i think we have an extra can of something somewhere and so we're gonna paint it white i think um but i don't know if you guys have seen this picture before we've had it since our honeymoon but i'll show it to you right now how cool is this i love it we got this on our honeymoon and it's been in a frame ever since Anyway, let's get on with our day. And I wake up in the morning, see the little floopster, see his little mittens. I don't know, something boopster? Give me a boop, let me give you a boop. I found my selfie stick. Yes, found my selfie stick. I found my selfie stick. What musical is that from? So I'm really glad that I got this selfie stick now because it's not just going to be me and my chin. In the video you can see some of my shoulders. And then I can just hold this for a lot longer and not be like, <laughs> I'm a fool, but you guys love me for that, right? I think at some point this weekend it needs to, I need to do some sort of like, some kind of cleaning in this little office and the rest of the house just because we are keeping on top of the kitchen and the living room for the most part but I don't know how it happens I move one thing here and there every day and it all just kind of piles up to being mess central Look at him, he's like lazy playing. Lazy. Come here. For dinner, I am making chicken katsu curry. So we've got the chicken going. We've got some veggies going. And we thankfully have some pre-made sauce and it smells amazing, so I can't wait to put this together. Oh, and I also made some rice. And here's our dinner. I didn't put my sauce on top of mine, I put mine on the bottom. And then Allie's is like everywhere. Allie's the gravy kid. <laughs> can you explain to people what a gravy kid is? I just love it. I can drink gravy. Yeah, yeah so. If you give it me in a jug, I can drink it. Yeah, so sauce. Am, am I the gravy kid on Easy Street? Oh, stop. Reference to the show. How's it taste? Please How's the chicken? Yeah, it's really good. The sauce is okay, it's just one that we bought in a glass. It's quite sweet. Yeah, that's why I brought that. sriracha over here because I'm gonna need some spice. Ready to watch <sighs> Tiger King? <laughs> We're on episode six now, so we'll see how this goes. I like being. What do you mean? So, Albus does this thing. I don't know if you can see us in the blanket, but this. Okay, this looks inappropriate, but I can assure you it's a cat. <laughs> Um, he goes under. So he goes under this blanket from down here. He crawls up onto the couch, and then he just goes meanies. It's okay, okay, okay go back to bed. We go back to bed. We're sorry. <laughs> but yeah, he's a little good boy. And we just—it's just weird. There's like this extra lump on the couch. It's another living being in our flat. There's three of us on the couch. <laughs> but yeah, I'm really happy to have this kitten boy. You stay in there. We love you. And we're, we're just watching Tiger King. We have Alice 20 minutes left. It. What? Albus has been enjoying it. Did you enjoy your dinner? Yeah, I just disappointed by the sauce. Yeah, thankfully it, was it wasn't sweet. me. No. <laughs> I had to Everything put lots of sriracha. Good. Oh, thank you. What do you think about the crispiness of the chicken? Yeah, it's really good. And the, the chicken was really tender as well. Yes. Yeah, it's great. Thank you. You're welcome. I'm very happy with how I cooked today. Well, you should be pleased. Okay, let's watch the last 20 minutes of this. 21 minutes of this. Oh, I love you. I love you too. We'll share our thoughts at the end, maybe. Okay. Okay, I love you. So, my skin is broken out pretty badly right now. If you can see that. 
I think that's because I have new medication and a mix of exfoliating where I shouldn't have exfoliated. Look, you look like a child with a beard. Thanks. I don't know whether that's a compliment or not. But like, because of the size difference. It's just I'm sitting back with my back sore. What do we think? About what? I don't know. The whole documentary makes me feel... It just, I don't the even whole know. Thing is just ridiculous. Like, <laughs> it just, it makes no sense. Yeah, and at the end, well, it's not really. They say it in the beginning too, but like, they put it into perspective that there's four thousand tigers in the wild, and in the U.S. alone, there's ten thousand. Like, why? Up do, to ten thousand. Why do people have a need thousand. to own a big cat? I think rich people sometimes are just bored. And some so. of them weren't rich, so that's the thing. It's not. I don't think it's. Yeah, I think in some countries, you get rich people buying big animals because they want to show off. But I wonder how many it is like really rich people that have them. Where it's just because I mean they, they were saying that they were able to sell them for like three thousand, four thousand. And I'm thinking some like dog breeds and cat breeds, like yeah. those kind of like very like pedigree ones. Mm -hmm. A house like domesticated, like proper pet, costs that much. Yeah. And I just think they should either be in the wild, or if there's like proper, like proper zoos, like yeah. name a proper zoo in the US. I don't know any. Like San Francisco. Yeah, like San Diego. So I guess those kind of places. Oh, yeah, San Diego. If there's ones that are in. I mean, I don't know too much about them. We don't know too much about them. No. But we feel like they're not privately owned. Or what, like so... it's not these small ones. And I think that if there's a say tigers that have been in captivity elsewhere in somewhere. And they can't be re-released, and there needs to be something done at home for them. Yeah, I don't properly think properly looked after with like vet care and yeah, we were saying like privately owned zoos shouldn't be a thing, and it's just not fair. Also, are you kidding me? Communities on here now. So we're just gonna wind down for the night, aren't we? Yeah. I had some low moments today where I just felt really lonely. Um, and it's kind of like really random, but I just thought I'd mm. share that a little bit, just because I just think. Uh, I, I sat alone for like half an hour while Ali was Ali was Ali was mm -hmm. taking a nap, and I just was like I'm bored. Today was kind of slow and sad. But anyway, for only a little part of it, then I started cooking yummy food, and it was mm. good. Stop yawning. We're gonna end the vlog here, but I hope you guys are doing okay, no matter what you're doing. I like me. What do you mean? <laughs>